Hey Brad, just got your message, man. Wanted to uh, make a quick video for you to help with the gross up payroll before I hit you back. So uh, when you are logged in, if you want to gross up a payroll, you click payroll. Ah, uh, shoot, sorry, log back in. So we'll click payroll. You're gonna head into your time entry grid. And then right here, instead of going straight into this big grid, you're going to click on this individual time entry. So if you want to do it for one employee or if everybody's getting a gross step check, that's fine. You can just pick the employee you want to start with. So we'll say Vince. And then right here, you're going to click add a check. Additional check, gross up. You're going to select their pay frequency and then leave the rest of this blank. Just save it. And then you'll notice that this line here is now highlighted, which means you can come into this grid and put in whatever the amount is. So we got gross up highlighted. We wanted this just to be a normal regular earning of, uh, we want it to be a $1,500 net. So you're just gonna type in 1,500. You can press refresh. So you'll see now that 1500 there. And then if you click this eyeball, it'll allow you to preview. So we'll see that the gross on that $1,500 net was 16, 24, 26. So you can just spot check that and make sure it looks good. We're gonna close preview. And then from here, you can either go to your time entry totals and process your payroll as usual. Or if you need to do this for additional employees, you can just jump through the employees one by one. Mario, add check. Mike, add a gross up check. And again, just remember when you add it, select gross up, pay frequency, disregard the rest, save, and make sure that that bar is highlighted when you come down here and you enter in the flat dollar amount that you want to be the net and then refresh and it'll gross it up. Let me know if you have any questions. See you.